Hello everyone and welcome back. Let's play Open XCOM Area 51. When we last left off, we have met a uh, couple of uh, sneaky snakes on board of uh, Spacefarer's craft. Uh, they killed, I think, one or two of our operatives. But uh, no biggie. Much more interesting news. We have uh, spotted a medium UFO. And we have uh, our Team B, which I have equipped off camera. Which is not really a Team B, because it's the guys with best uh, firing accuracy, um, which were not on Team A. Team A is still on the other craft. I've uh, equipped you. And since we know that mediums always land, at least in the original game, we'll uh, risk it and uh, try to follow these guys as well. Oh, and there's a landing site somewhere. Where is it? It's even closer. Let's go there. Oh, and these guys have landed too. Wow, we will have two missions. <laughs> All right. Well, let's begin. We have Myrtle Carer, the Rocketeer, Pritza, the Gauss weapon, um, Ragnar, our commander and sniper with uh, backup Gauss rifle. Actually, I should probably give you Gauss rifle because we have two other snipers. And um, Tarnum Iron Fist. Many people have also stun rods. I will try to stun many aliens. Munasha with the grenade launcher. Hartenstein, Nocturnal, Cannon Fodder, Skaber, Gruy Goo, Dead Man Zem, Private Bjorn II, Reneko, Grenadier Noob, and that's everybody. So, that doesn't look very good. Mm. What do we want to do? <laughs> I mean, preventively, we should probably fire a rocket right inside here. I would love to fire right inside there, but I don't think anybody can go here. So, just in case somebody's waiting, you know, like here or here or here or here, and we of course don't see them because of lines of fire, we should probably fire with the rocket launcher now. It's a relatively small map for a medium UFO. They can be waiting here for us. They can be waiting here, here, there and there. They can be anywhere, basically. Alright, Pritza. Come down. Looks good. This way, no one. This way. Really? Okay. This way? Ah, oh, look at that. Hello. 30%. 26%. Wow, you were lucky. <laughs> you were lucky, Pritza. Okay. So nobody there. That makes me believe even more that there is somebody right here. Myrtle, duck and aim shot. Right here. There was someone behind the door. I knew it. What else? This one. We probably should... Uh, we probably should uh, throw a heavy explosive over there. So, who would like to throw? Um, you're not strong enough. You're strong enough, Ragnar. So, you'll come... Probably here. Yeah, you should have enough. Especially if he moves. Like this. Put down the smoke, by the way. And Ragnar needs to get 
this heavy explosive from Unashe. And run somewhere over here. Maybe open this one as well. There was one, there might be more. I guess we would see this guy. Okay, let's not actually risk our commander. Let's go down with uh, Iron Fist first. Actually looks good. I still want to blow this up. So let's do it. Ragnar. Oh, throwing it on the second floor would be probably even better. Hmm. All right. So from here. Can't throw there. All right. So that's already a no-go. Maybe, maybe right in front of this door. Yeah. So that's explosive number one. I think we can open something over here too. Who wants to throw? 37 on Hartenstein. That's very good. Somebody needs to throw you a very big explosive. Oh, we have Nocturnal who can fire. Maybe if we can open this door we can throw something or maybe you can open mm. or you know what where are you nocturnal you need 43 and then nobody else will be able to move How about making a big hole over there? Don't see anyone. Maybe a big hole over here too. Mm. I would love to have the... Whatchamacallit... the proxies now. Hartenstein can throw. We can also go here. That's safe. From here I shouldn't get shot. I don't think so at least. We will have some cover here. From the smoke. Okay, move around, move aside. Cannon fodder. Shoot at anything that moves. Gru, shoot at anything that moves. You as well, and the rest will just wait. Don't kill anyone. <laughs> so, I would love to have uh, blown up this building as well, but it will have to wait until the next turn. Nobody died over there on the left. And we don't see anyone. All right. Ragnar, good job with the explosion, but didn't help. Hartenstein, let's uh, have a look. Nobody there. Cannon fodder. You are a bit too far. Gru. No 
nobody there. Okay, so nobody anywhere. Let's therefore position ourselves. Snipers. Right here. Well, you can't actually go that far. Okay. All right, everybody position themselves. You are in a good position face this way. You need to go out. There will be fine. You need to go here. Private. Second private. You need to go there. Next. Grenadier noob. Hmm. Right in the middle. <laughs> All right, you need to reload. And stay there. Pritza. Come closer. Ragnar. Maybe you can prepare a second heavy explosive. Nah, stay here. Tarnu will help you. And Munasha will go and help you. Hartenstein is good. You can even make one more step. Nocturnal is fine, needs to reload. And come closer. Oh, whoa, 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 what do my eyes see? Duck, don't kill anyone. Except for that guy, of course. Good job, cannon fodder, I didn't believe in you, but you proved me wrong. Oh no! Who was there? Who did they target? Everybody seems to have full morale. Yeah, maybe they were unsuccessful. Alright. Tarnum, scouting duty. Nobody in this building. Really? Yeah, nobody. Okay. Hmm, that was unfortunate. But maybe Ragnar can save the day. 39. And you need to fire from somewhere over here. Yeah, that's more than enough. 78%. Good job. You can count on the commander. Nocturnal, I do want to make a big boom here. Duck and shoot. Hmm. Nothing. Okay. Where's my second rocketeer? There you are. Ah, you're inside, of course. Do I want to make another boom right here? Nah. Nah, I don't. Alright, Bjorn doesn't have a scanner. Check it out, nothing. All right. Ooh, 
Whoa, how did you not die in the explosion? <laughs> how did you not die? Can't shoot. Hmm. Well, we can probably shoot from... Well, nowhere really. Can't lob a grenade over here either. We could lob a heavy explosive somehow if we had somebody with really good arm. Grenadier noob. 25 is not gonna do it. Gru is too far away. You have not enough time units. Uh, you can't... Hartenstein could theoretically, but I don't think so. I guess we'll have to believe in higher powers and um, go away from here. And from here. And from here. But we can't. further closer sniper over there second sniper over here that should do all right maybe you can do what could you do I should have really taken those proxy grenades now I'm <laughs> Just stay over there, people. Don't do much. Is this safe? No, it's not. Come here. Ah, oh, too bad you have to stay there. Shouldn't have ducked. Maybe I should make a big hole here as well, just in case. Do you think anyone can come from here or from here? They might. But um, Hartenstein is dangerously close. Don't shoot. All right, we were lucky, people. He didn't see us. We were quite lucky. And we don't see anyone. All right, let's uh, start here. This, this part looked safer. <laughs> Maybe even is. Ragnar still alive? Alright, so we knew that what there was someone here. Nocturnal can reload first, stand up second, and hide third. Nobody there. I want to send a scout, but we we have people with good accuracy only <laughs> on this mission. So that's rather suboptimal. Hartenstein, see anything? That's us. Okay, nobody there. Come back. Let's wait a little bit more. Nothing happening. Scout, nothing. 
Scout nothing. What's going on here? Really? Nobody here. <laughs> okay, I can't explain that very well. We'll, uh, we'll go up. Nobody there. Okay, one sniper come closer. Oops, what do we see here? Jeez. Okay. Evacuate. And... Evacuate. That was too close. Okay. So how do we how do we do this? We cannot shoot from here because there's a roof on top. So we just need to wait for him to come closer. Basically, no other way around it. And we need to be oh, he can still see us from here, but he's far away. He's far away. Maybe we can reposition nocturnal and make a big hole here. Yeah, let's do that. All right, then Nothing. <sighs> I don't want to go here by foot. Maybe through here. Maybe there's a better angle. Come closer. Come closer. Come closer. Come closer. And stay there. Next. Nada. Nine and four. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, one, two, three, four. He's inside. Over here. Can't shoot through. I could go through here, but at least with two people. At least. For now, I will ignore him. There's someone. Good job. Maybe I should have taken him alive. So far so good though. Let's take a sniper rifle. Oh, there's another one. Jeez. <laughs> Where did you come from? Where did you come from? Even from the closest distance, he needed two shots. That's why you don't risk anything. All right. So, the problem is right here. We need to go back. We might need to still... Go 
duck and make a big door right there that should allow us to shoot effectively well more effectively than usual <laughs> okay that's cover and that's cover all right you can come closer Oh, whoa, 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 another, another Rocketeer. All right. Totally forgot about you. You are going to make yet another hole here. Some other day. Tarnum, take cover. Monashe is fine, Nocturnal is fine. Cannon fodder is not fine, but let's stay there. And you go even further. Turn around, Skaber. Oh no! Oh no! How did they do that? No! Pritza! How could you? How could you, Pritza? Bad Pritza. <laughs> bad, bad Pritza. Jeez, how do you have more? <laughs> Come on, you just shot. I wanted to stun you, dang it. We won't be friends like that. You know that, right? There he is. Duck. Kill. Okay. Alright, we need to get away from here. Because we are getting uh, fired upon. Right. I'm not sure about you and not sure if uh, this was the last guy either let's try like no it wasn't see that wasn't the last guy hmm so maybe maybe we can uh, throw a surprise <laughs> in that general direction I don't think you can shoot, but might as well try. Nocturnal. Nocturnal could prepare the grenade and Myrtle could throw it. Yeah, let's try it like this. Prime. Throw. Pick it up. Throw it further. Pick it up. And throw it right there. Bye. Zam, go away from the traitor. <laughs> Next turn. You know what? Maybe we'll even uh, help you. How do you feel about it, Hartenstein? Do we want to help them? Maybe.
Healing aliens, Hartenstein. What else does that crazy commander? Oops. What from us? No. <laughs> but he won't have a gun. He won't have a gun. Hey, where did he go? Huh? Am I crazy? Let's save that. <laughs> I will have a look later. Okay. Next. Are you back with us, Pritza? Yes, you are. You just killed two people, Pritza. You will be renamed once I figure out how to do it. Probably can't do it here. You will be renamed to Mind Control Puppet. You will get uh, a non-lethal weapon, Ritza. And you will go first. <laughs> you will go first. The rest hide. It's all right. Even Ragnar, just here. Uh, who else? Okay, Skaber can start coming closer. Dead Man Zem, Private Bjorn. Do we have a, Do we have a stun rod? Hartenstein has one. Okay. That's fine, Hartenstein, that's fine. Um, you have a standard as well. We really don't see that guy. I have no idea where he is. No idea. And you don't have a gun. You can get the guy from the killed guys. Good job, cannon fodder. You'll be you'll be scouting over here with your motion scanner. I don't get this. Where was he? <laughs> Where on earth was he? He must have been like inside that thingy. I don't have any other explanation. Sweet dreams. Now oh, he's still... He's still hurt. That's not good. We still need to help him, otherwise he's gonna... I don't know, maybe... Okay. If he dies, he dies. We are going forward. That's fine. Take non-lethal weapons and uh, face that way. There's a ton of them. There's a ton of them. <laughs> okay, come closer. We'll definitely, definitely need a heavy explosive here. Ritza, you have one. You might even want to sacrifice yourself if you weren't panicked, of course. Ragnar, you need a different weapon man first. Maybe even this high explosive. That's fine, and everybody closer at least some cover behind that phone booth you can get a weapon from a dead guy 
well, a stun weapon. Maybe from the second dead guy, something that can actually shoot. Scaber, closer. Gru, closer. Dead man Zam, closer. Those sniper rifles won't be good, actually. We need something else. And again, just one entrance. Hmm. All right, Medic Hartenstein. It's a soldier. I don't really need a soldier, but he's worth more money if he's patched up. <laughs> So let's do this a little bit quicker, shall we? There's tons and tons of them. One is one, two and there. One, two and there. Right in front of me. Bjorn, are you a hero? Tarnum, are you a hero? No, because he's there. He's up there. Okay. In that case, Ragnar, right here, right here, right there. We have a very, very little energy left. And I don't like having such a bottleneck. Why can't we just have a second door? Uh, 12 units, two guys dead. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Where's the other two? The other two are here. Okay, Nocturnal. You can take a gun too. Continue and Pritza. Ah, Pritza wants the one mind controlled, so you're not getting a high explosive, and you will be the one opening the doors and things. Yes. Yeah, see, that's why. All right, Ragnar Who wants to open the door. There he is. <laughs> oh, it's not primed. It's not freaking primed. Does he see me? That's the question. I think he sees me. Well, Ragnar, we might lose a commander. We just lost a commander. Good job, though. Hey, that was like a triple kill or something. <laughs> that was a little double kill, maybe. And someone actually survived it. Medic and a corpse. Okay, medic. We're gonna help you too. Soon. Ah, oh, we lost our commander. They are not gonna be happy back at the base. I might get a formal 
reprimand, or how do you call it? <laughs> um, yeah, everybody inside. I would like to take many alive, if possible. Hartenstein, do you think this guy will stay like this? I don't think so. You'll need to go and uh, watch him. And Nocturnal as well. Come closer. Oh no, look at that helmet! No, what? No, 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 no! No, 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 whoa, whoa, no, whoa, stop. <laughs> Jeez, there's a bazillion of them there. Ouch. What a nerf, and this guy died? No, he didn't. Alright, one down, but there's like at least two more. Yeah, look at them. What shall we do? I think we could shoot at one. No. Well, we can uh, we can throw a grenade again, maybe. That's 30, 40 something. Yeah, let's have a let's have a try. <laughs> Let them fry. sure if you will be able to do that. Uh, you might. Yeah, Bjorn, you will probably do the same. Need 14. There's good. Save that uh, medic. Mm. And face this way. Yeah. <laughs> I hope you're roasting good. I hope you are. Where is the. Oh, hello. I knew why I leave you here. Let's help this guy as well. Oh, you have panic, Tarnum? Come on. Come on. There's a guy facing away. Nobody else. I'm coming closer. Take him alive. Where's our... Uh... Ah, that hurts. You are far away. You need also a different weapon. This one. Sir. All right. Who else? Uh, Tarnum, you're standing on top of someone uh, that can provide stun rods. Munashe, where are you? Ah, next time, next time, Munashe. Hartenstein, unfortunately, you have to stay. Nocturnal. All right, Nocturnal. Go 
closer to. And let's wait. Somebody died. Fire magically disappeared. <laughs> what? Look at that. Fire disappeared. He's on fire. <laughs> oh, look at that. Burning. Poor little sectoid. Soldier. Maybe I should start killing them. Oh, hello. You're not burning. Who are you? Scientist. Ooh. That's new. All right. Nocturnal right here. Bjorn right there. Mr. Carer. Ah, this guy must have died. Yeah, that was the second guy on fire. That was the second guy on fire. Gru. Closer. You don't stand on a corpse on fire, please. Okay. And that man, Zem, you really don't have much else. Uh, well, we know there's uh, more here. So put that down, put this up and this up. And come here. All right. This guy most likely died. Yep, he burned alive. <laughs> this guy is a scientist. I don't know what scientists do, but I probably should try to save him. And let's take Nocturnal first. Nothing. Gru second. Nasha third and everybody else now. We'll take them all alive. We need leaders, we need engineers, we need navigators. We need everybody we can get. Like this. Pritza is still out of his mind. Oh no, oh no, oh no, who was that? Who was that? That was Tarnum Iron Fist. Tarnum, your weapon privileges have been revoked. And uh, therefore, you will be the first to go as well. <laughs> Well, happens. <laughs> Who wants to go next? Who wants to go next? Um, where is he? He's right there. Maybe we can shoot at him. We can't stun him. Okay, Gru, good job. Good job, Gru. There's one more. Go down. You've done your job. Bjorn. No. Nocturnal. Good job there. That's a leader. We need a leader as well. Come back. Stay here. Wow. We are 
quite successful. Stay there, Bjorn, and that man Zem here, and Skaber right where you are. We'll probably not need this weapon next turn. All right, there can't be too many left. This is a dead end. Something strange over here, some artifact. All right, so nothing this way. I should start using the scanners. <laughs> You don't have one. Who has a scanner? This guy is still asleep. Pizza can go and uh, try scanners, maybe. Okay, somebody must have a scanner. Dead guy. I don't know who's who. Turn 18, somebody opened the door. 7 and 3. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one, two, three. That's very dangerous. It's very dangerous. Smoke might not help us. You know what? I will take the leader into safety. Somewhere over here. Actually, Nocturnal can take him even. Even further to safety. Now we have a leader and a, what was it? A, a, a scientist, I believe. We'll just wait this guy out. That man Zam, no. Gru, no. Skaber, definitely no. Hmm. Okay, Gru, come closer. Uh, we again need some volunteer with the... Scanner. Where are you people? I was so well prepared. Where are you all? <laughs> How many people did we lose? Oh, we lost five already. Wow. Mostly to friendly fire. No? Basically, these two guys died to friendly fire. Uh, this guy not. This guy... I don't even remember. This one definitely died to enemy fire. So two to enemy fire. That was a very big WTF moment. <laughs> and this guy, how did you die? Oh, that was our commander. Jeez, that was our commander. He threw an explosive, almost killed three, but um, they just reaction fired at him. Yeah, commander down. Commander down. Okay, next turn. Well, that man Zem. I hope this is a commander. Oh, it's not the last guy either. Navigator. We need navigators too. 
Okay. Take them all, take them alive, dang it. But try not dying in the process. <laughs> Who's next? Oh yes, Pritza, of course. Pritza. You're a very useless soldier. You will be going first. Mr. Kerrer, prepare. Nocturnal. Prepare as well. Ouch! Bjorn! <laughs> Sorry, man. Really? Zero, zero, zero? What is he made of? Oh, that's it. That's it. Seven operatives killed, but we have captured a lot of very important targets. So, 12 aliens killed, seven alive, so that's 19 together. Seven aliens recovered. Very good job. Seven live aliens for seven killed operatives. I think that's a good trade. <laughs> Two power sources, five navigations, one examination room, 100 delirium. People who survived got even some bravery. Myrtle Kara got bravery. Congratulations. Uh, not much accuracy. Some melee improvement from using those um, stun rods. And we got a lot of heavy plasmas, plasma rifles, plasma pistols, grenades, illyrium, sectoid corpses, blah, blah, and so on. So we have one leader, one engineer, two medics, one navigator, one soldier, and one scientist. I wonder what the scientist is. We should probably investigate him first, interrogate him first. Okay, we have a legion of valor. That's new, isn't it? I learned that courage was not the absence of fear, but the triumph over it. Yeah, that's for 10 uh, bravery. Legion of Valor. You deserved it. Nocturnal gets a bold cross. That's definitely new, right? Captain Stephen Hiller. You know, this was supposed to be my weekend off, but no. You got me out here dragging your heavy ass through the burning desert with your draglot dreadlocks sticking out the back of my parachute. Independence Day. <laughs> I didn't remember the Stephen Hiller name, but I know that he's played by uh, the same guy from iRobot. <laughs> I forgot the name I'm making. Uh, fun of myself here. Actually, not fun. That's, that's just sad that I don't remember the name. What's his name? Jeez. The guy from Man in Black. Will Smith. Yeah, that's him. Alright. This high commendation recognizes a critical accomplishment in the capture of a high-value target. Ah, okay. Enemy leaders and commanders are sure to give us a better understanding of alien goals and ways we can defeat them. This award is presented once to any soldier that captures one of these important targets. So obviously Nocturnal captured a leader. Looks like it. Angel's Cross is what exactly? Ah, that's uh, reviving casualties. I think... Um, that is going to be fixed as well, because I don't think we revived our guys. Yeah, I think JG is actually fixing this uh, this medal as we speak. Athena Citation and Order of the Earth is fine. So Bolt's Cross is the new one for capturing high-level aliens. Alright, and we have some losses, some significant losses. Our commander, Ragnar, the sniper, 14 kills has been killed by a reaction fire. Totally my mistake, but was worth it, I guess. Tarnum Iron Fist, one kill. I don't know if this was your first mission in your second incarnation or not, but um, 
You definitely did well. Cannon fodder has died finally after 7 kills. I'm surprised you lasted that long. Dead man Zem. Mm. Well, how did you die? Oh yeah, you were just killed. You took you took one for the team. At the end. That's that's noble. Good way to die. Private Bjorn from Netherlands has died as well. He got Prowler Cross, what is that? Ah. Yeah. Kills with stuff. <laughs> and Grenadier Noob, his second incarnation again, after one kill. Alright. Well, there's a new post open for a commander, <laughs> for a field commander. Don't know who wants it, but I know that we will need a second team to go after landing site 9 ASAP. So, I will save just here. And when we come back, we'll do the same. This time, I think I won't go after live captures that much. We already have like... Do we have an engineer? We do have an engineer. So we have engineer, navigator, scientist, leader, navig one more navigator. Yeah, I think we don't have to go for the captures anymore. Unless we come across a commander or something, but I think we'll need a mind probe for that. I'm not just going to randomly stun guys until I get one. Alright, so a little bit over one hour. A nice long episode. And a lot of uh, things happen. <laughs> Hopefully it will be less eventful next time. Till then, bye bye.